Shabbat Shalom, everybody. Something amazing happened to me this week. A student sent me a video of my father-in-law, Reb Zalman Schachter, giving over his life story. It starts with him explaining that his name is Mishalem Zalman, and he's able to give over 10 generations of where we come. This morning, I showed that to my son, Mishalem Zalman, and explained to him that he received the name from his grandfather, and this is your ancestry. In this week's Parsha, Chaye Sarah were all gifted the same thing. Sarah Imenu, the mother of all of the Jewish people, died. Avraham Avinu, her husband Avraham, wanted to bury her in a place that would be ours, that of the Jewish people. And he says, Viten li ma'arat ha I want to buy, give to me, the ma'arat ha-machpelah. Asher lo b'kce sadeu b'kesef male yidnen ali. That at the edge of the field, I will pay full price for it. Rashi goes on to explain that the reason it says I will pay full price is that they wanted to give it to him, either to gift it or to be able to take it back. But Avram said, no, I want full ownership of this. Why? Not only to have a burial place for my wife, but also to leave it for all of the generations. And that's us. Our strength lies in knowing who we are and from where we come. We are all the children of Sarah Imenu. We are all defined by that strength from generation to generation. This week, as we, as we celebrate the cemetery board and we understand the importance of honoring our ancestors, may we all also celebrate our strength from where we come delve deeper in both understanding and telling our children who we are and what defines us as the Jewish people. We're never defined by what others say we are. We are defined by who we are, what we've give, been given, the gift of the Torah, and understanding the strength that lies within that and within each of all of us. Good Shabbos.